Hello Scorpio, welcome to a you and them love reading for February. We're going to be looking at what's going on in your connection and how you feel about each other. As always, these readings are meant to be general, so take what applies to you and leave the rest. You can also check out your other placements, your moon, your rising sign, or any other sign of significance. Sometimes those can resonate more. All of the playlists are linked in the description box for each uh, zodiac sign, so you can check those out. All right, so let's get into it for Scorpio. Spirit, angel, spells, for Scorpio, guarding love for February 2022. Let me know. Let me know for Scorpio. So let's look at what's going on in your connection with this person that you are thinking about or connecting with at this time. What do we need to know about this connection, Spirit? What do we need to know? about this connection the lovers gemini energy what's going on in this connection between scorpio and their person what's going on in this connection five of pentacles reverse what's going on in this connection scorpio and their person queen of cups reverse Okay, so I feel like there's someone that wants to have a recovery. With the Five of Pentacles reverse, turning that around. And this is a very strong connection, possibly even a soulmate connection with the lovers. Okay, so then let's put down your energies and this person's energies and then we'll look a little bit more at this connection. Tell me about Scorpio. What do we need to know about Scorpio's energy, Spirit? What do we need to know about Scorpio's energies? The Hierophant, Taurus energy. What do we need to know about Scorpio's energy? What do we need to know about Scorpio's energies? Three of Cups, reverse. Okay, tell me about Scorpio's person. What do we need to know about Scorpio's person? know about Scorpio's person. The Wheel of Fortune reverse. What do we need to know about Scorpio's person? What do we need to know about Scorpio's person? The Moon reverse. Can we get one more? Seven of Cups. The Moon reverse. Interesting. Pisces energy there. Some sort of reveal, something coming to the surface, something being seen clearly here. Let's get a little bit more clarity on these energies. Can I get some more insight, please, on what's going on in this connection between Scorpio and this other person? What's going on in this connection between Scorpio and this other person. Judgment call? What's going on? Difficult decision. Okay. What is it with Scorpios and decisions? I swear, all of your readings, there's some sort of decision. Okay, what else for Scorpio and this person? What else do we need to know? Oh, no. Oh, wow, the tower. Okay, what else do we need to know? What else do we need to know for Scorpio and this person and this connection? Successful, accomplished, and stable. Okay. Closed off, difficult decision, and judgment call. I think a, to a tower might have already happened here. Or this decision will lead to a tower. This difficult decision, this judgment call. Um, Scorpio, you have the higher font and the three of cups reversed. Now, um, I have you on one side and your person on the other. So feel free to flip these energies if they resonate more for you. But I'm thinking that you are already involved with someone or you already have a connection that exists. A third party that exists. And your person here is trying to figure out a way 
or make some sort of choice here with the seven of cups to turn this wheel around and that I feel is going to cause a tower this moon reverse most likely a reveal of some sort Aw, loyal faithful and dependable I think you and this person are most likely not together but you've been loyal to each other or one of you has been loyal to the other so let's get some insight here what's going on two of cups and the ten of swords okay yeah there is definitely some there's history here and that's why there's this uh, element of like recovering something with the five of cups reverse can we get some clarity for scorpio spirit clarity guidance please for scorpio tell me about the five of pentacles reverse Five of Pentacles, Reverse. What's this about? Seven of Swords. Tell me. Eight of Pentacles. Tell me about the Five of Pentacles, Reverse. Ten of Swords. Yeah, I feel like someone's behavior led to an ending. And now it's like they want to work on him. I don't, what, what? This is like a running theme for so many signs. Tell me about the Lovers. Now we have the Queen of Cups reverse. So someone's like unhappy, heartbroken. Tell me about the lovers. I think whatever ending this this was, I think you'd, you're still loyal to each other. Tell me about the lovers. Ten of Pentacles. Tell me about the lovers. Eight of Wands, Four of Wands, the High Priestess, and the Five of Cups. Yeah, I think that despite the separation or the difficulties in your connection, I think that secretly you still think about each other, you miss each other, you're disappointed or have regrets over the past. That's why the Queen of Cups is here reverse. Tell me about the Queen of Cups reverse. Tell me about the Queen of Cups, reverse. Page of Wands. The Devil, Capricorn Energy. Judgment, my goodness. Someone could have gotten involved with a karmic partner. And now I think they're making a judgment call about that. Yeah, there's the tower. It's all connected. So I feel like someone's realizing they're in a karmic situation or they are in, stuck in a karmic cycle. And I think this is leading to a tower. Let's get some insight into your energies. I think there's a third party involved. Some sort of attachment or unhealthy dynamic that is affecting someone in the present. Despite the fact that this was kind of like a decision made in the past. Tell me about Scorpio. Tell me about Scorpio. Courtship. Tell me about Scorpio's person. Tell me about Scorpio's person. Unexpected income. Yeah, I think that someone here is going to speak up. And I think it's your person, Scorpio. Or there's some sort of opportunity that appears that someone's going to take. Now you have courtship, which is kind of like the beginning stages of a connection. So I wonder if you are hoping for this, but I am very confused because you have the three of cups reversed. So either you're thinking of a third party or you are in a third party. I'm not sure how courtship can happen in the midst of all that. Tell me about Scorpio. Tell me about Scorpio. I'm working on myself. Tell me about Scorpio's person. 
Tell me about Scorpio's person. You matter to me. Scorpio, you might have been... I want to see you and I'm confused. Is that Seven of Cups? I wasn't honest with you at the bottom of the deck. Scorpio, I feel like you've been trying to like stay busy or have improved, done some healing, inner child healing, or just have improved as a person. This person, they still care about you, whoever they are. They still care about you. Enough to cause a tower. I mean, I feel like that is unavoidable here. This tower. So let's look at your energies. Tell me about the Hierophant in the Three of Cups reverse. Why is the Hierophant here with the Three of Cups reverse? The world. Why is the Hierophant here with the Three of Cups reverse? Ace of Pentacles. I get one more of the higher font with the Three of Cups. Reverse. Tell us more about these energies. The Star and the Four of Swords. And then the Lovers at the bottom of the deck. Healing, Hope, Faith, Renewal, Aquarius energy here with the Star. Gemini energy again with the Lovers. Um, I think you're hoping for a second chance with this person, Scorpio. I think you're hoping to be able to start again. I think you think about this person a lot or this connection a lot with the Four of Swords and the Lovers here. And yeah, <clears throat> maybe they're doing really great. Tell me about the Seven of Cups. Why is the Seven of Cups here? Strength, Leo energy. Why is the Seven of Cups here? Strong enough to make a choice. Page of Swords. Nine of Cups. So this is someone that has something in mind, an idea in mind, a wish, a goal. <clears throat> Page of Swords, maybe they're watching you, observing you, doing research, talking to certain people before making this decision. This decision will require courage, and that makes sense because there's a tower involved with this decision. King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy, and the Ten of Wands. I feel like this person wants to do the right thing. King of Pentacles. Um, they don't want to cut corners, this person. They're thinking things very, um, I don't know. I'm getting someone that's thinking ar around all of the obstacles. Tell me about the moon reverse. Why is the moon reverse? Why is the moon reverse? Ten of cups. Why is the moon reverse? Five of swords. Why is the moon reverse? The lovers. Five of Swords, Ten of Cups. I think this is going to cause some sort of conflict. This is possibly about what happened between you as well. And I feel like this Moon Reverse is tied to a decision. Knight of Wands, Two of Wands. Yeah, Seven of Pentacles. It's like someone's wondering how this is going to play out once they make this decision. I think this person's going to come forward and say something. I want to see you is here. Tell me about the moon reverse. One more, please. One more, please, about this moon reverse. What do we need to know about this moon reverse? Queen of Wands. And then there's the tower. I think this person is going to make the choice to see you or to express how they feel towards you, Scorpio. And for whatever reason, this is going to lead to other things with the tower. Yeah, nine of cups and the tower. The tower will allow someone to have their desire, um, to have their wish granted. It's connected, it's all connected. Um, this might be something unexpected. 
Um, this person has really thought about how to make this decision in such a way that it brings about their wish. So they're being very strategic about what they're going to do. Very logical. This involves you in some way. I think that not only are they going to reveal something or something's going to come out, something's going to be revealed, but there's some sort of action too that someone's going to make. Um, I don't know, maybe they come visit you. Maybe they, they take, you know, they, they make certain decisions and physically follow through. I, I'm just picturing someone that's very active here with the Knight of Wands, Queen of Wands here. And I think with the Five of Swords, I think other people might be involved. There might be conflict that arises or some sort of challenge. Can I get one more um, for the Moon Reverse? get one more energy for this moon reverse yeah queen of swords i think someone's definitely going to talk and it's going to be this hermit virgo energy at the bottom of the deck it's like someone was closed off quiet doing their own thing and then they come in queen of swords what's behind this yeah and this is what someone was thinking they were probably thinking about what to say before they come forward they probably were really thinking about how to say something, what to say, you know. And they're going to come clean about something or just express themselves here. And it's going to be kind of surprising. I think that you always hope that this would happen, but maybe there wasn't any action or communication until now. Page of Wands is here and the Devil is here. So the, I'm going to take this to the extended because I want to know where all of this is headed, especially with this Tower moment. Um, what's going to happen next? What can you expect next, Scorpio? Um, and then I'm going to look at this person's intentions towards you um, because the Seven of Cups, it's definitely somebody that has, and the Nine of Cups, they have a goal in mind. Their intentions are based off of a future goal or success that they envision. So I want to know what that's all about. What's, you know, why are they coming forward now? <clears throat> so if you want to know more insight or get some additional uh, bonus information, then check out the extended. It's linked in the description box as always. Otherwise, I'll leave it here, Scorpio. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the reading. If you did, hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you all in another video very soon. Take care.